Orange Babies charity organization in Riobot on Monday launched its new computer lab courtesy of the United States of America Embassy in Namibia. Your Excellency, thank you so much for speaking to Nampa News. Uh, the American Embassy, how did it came that you get involved in the project in Riobot with the Orange Babies? It's very simple. We have a program called the Ambassador's Self-Help Fund that is an open application process and organizations like Orange Babies can put in an application proposing a specific project like this one and if it meets the requirements of the fund and it wins in the competition because we get many more applications than we have money for unfortunately then we fund it and that's how this one got funded. Orange Babies is an international organization which helps HIV infected pregnant women and their babies. It also supports children who are infected with the virus or who are otherwise directly affected. Orange Babies Riobot Manager Irene Maton and three volunteers run the day-to-day -day activities of the center. What is your big dream for Orange Babies, especially in Riobot, and for the town of Riobot, the women of Riobot? What is your big, big dream out there? My big dream uh, will be that um, every single person um, will have a chance to, to really stand on their own feet. And uh, if I have the money and the time and whatever, I will work 24 hours a day to make a, a really a difference in the life of people. I hate it to see people suffer. And um, um, if I can, I will really help and teach women because I realize if you teach women, you teach the whole community. Um, in um, my big dream for Riobot is that we became a proud nation. A nation that, um, um, you know, the Riobot are sometimes associated as a place of uh, where people drink too much, people are lazy, people are. But um, I know, it might be the truth, but I know also of very good people. And um, I think if we start with the gener um, younger generation, we can really make a big, big difference. Women empowerment is strongly on the agenda, as they equip women with the necessary skills, such as needlework, catering, gardening and computer skills, to become employed and self-employed. Amy, thank you for speaking to Nampa News. You are also one of the beneficiaries of uh, House Orange here in Riobot. What does this training mean to you as a person of this community? Um, as a person of this community, this training means a lot to me. At school, I was a very good typist, but I thought it was it. But then, then I heard about Orange Babies. So I only thought Orange Babies was for pregnant women to give milk and to care about them. But then I find out they were uh, giving these computer classes. And it was just 30, it is just $30 per month, which is a reasonable amount to scratch together, even if you are not working, and to just pay. What did this course mean to you for in person yourself? It really means a lot to me. But presently, I'm a core trainer at Orange Babies at the computer lab. Would you encourage other women also to follow suit? I really want to do it because a lot of women get work due to the computer training, and it's nice working with ladies here. Over 85 students have graduated from the Orange Baby Skills Training Center thus far, and more than half of them are currently employed or self-employed. Orange Babies is based in the Netherlands and has branches in Namibia, South Africa and Zambia.